Hi, welcome to Sylvie's Technique Vlog. Um, I'm going to be talking about using elbows in sparring and clinch, which I really love, and it's been something that I've probably been doing for over a year now, but I do much, much more, and ha it's become a much bigger part of my clinching and sparring experience. Um, a lot of people totally omit elbows from clinching and sparring because it's risky, which is a completely reasonable reason <laughs> to not use elbows uh, against your teammates because you can totally accidentally hurt each other, cut each other, anything like this. Um, but the reason to train them is because one, you're training the trigger, two, you can actually turn it into a game and make it more lighthearted and bring elbows into the context of how you would actually be using them in the movements of clinching and sparring. Um, and three, it's, I think that there's this kind of tendency to think of elbows as only like bad blood or like really bad technique that you only throw when you hate somebody, which isn't how you should think about elbows at all. So when you're clinching and sparring, you don't have to like elbow your opponent, your clinching and sparring partner in the face. This counts as an elbow, so, right? You call it out as you're going. When I play with Karahat, he won't throw the kick at all. He'll go like this, and I feel like I could have been hit by that kick. It's the same concept for throwing elbows.